Hey guys, so I decided to create this summer day makeup look and I am using my Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette as well as my Naked 3 Palette. So I did already moisturize my face, now I'm just priming my face with this Laura Mercier Hydrating Foundation Primer. And I'm going to take this NYX Angel Veil Primer. This primer really smooths out my skin and it hides any pores that I may have on my cheeks. And it just really prepares my skin for my foundation. Now for foundation, the cover girl 3 in 1 in 857. And I'm taking this flat top brush by BH Cosmetics just to smooth in my foundation. And then I'm going to blend it out with my BH Cosmetics beauty sponge. Now moving on to eyes, I'm taking Soft Ochre Paint Pot by MAC and this just really makes your eyeshadow last all day long. This is a really good primer for your eyes and it just makes everything nice and even for your shadow. So I'm just applying it with my ring finger and then I'm going to apply my eyebrows with this Anastasia Dip Brow in Ebony. You guys have seen me do my eyebrows like a good trillion times so I know you guys are probably bored of it but I just wanted to show it nice and close. So I'm taking this light pink color from the chocolate bar palette and I'm going to be using it as my transition color. I really really like that shadow as a transition color and I'm just applying it with a blending brush by Sigma. Now I'm taking this color Nooner from the Naked 3 palette and I'm just applying it right on top of my crease and just blending it out. Now with this darker shade from the chocolate bar palette, I'm going to take this pointed brush by Beige Cosmetics and I'm just going to focus that color on the outer V of my eye and I'm just going to pack up and build that color. Now I'm taking this nice shimmery pink color with a small flat eyeshadow brush and I'm just going to pack that color onto my lids. And after that I'm going to spray my brush with MAC Fix Plus just a little bit so I can really intensify that color and make it look a little bit more metallic. Now with this nice matte vanilla color from the chocolate bar palette, I'm going to apply it right underneath my eyebrows 
just to give it a little bit of a highlight and then I'm going to blend the crease color with the highlight color together. Now I'm taking these makeup remover pads and I'm just going to clean up my shadow and prepare my eyes for my winged eyeliner which I will be using my e.l.f. cream liner and this angled brush by BH Cosmetics. Now for lashes, I'm taking my Red Cherry 43 lashes and this dual glue and I'm just going to apply them with some tweezers. Now for concealer, this is my probably my favorite part because it just makes a huge difference. It really lifts up your face and your eyes. So I'm taking my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade Sand and then I'm going to blend it out and I'm going to bake uh, my concealer, like really really set it with the Air Spun Translucent Powder. So I'm just going to set my eyes and I'm going to let this powder sit on my face for a little bit and while I wait I'm just going to contour my face with the Too Faced Contour Kit. I've been using this in almost all my videos because I really really like the shades and I like how long it lasts and I love how it blends. It's very very creamy but it's a powder. But the shades are very very nice. I'm so happy that I can use the dark one. I really like how it looks. And I'm just going to blend it with this uh, BH Cosmetics brush. Here I'm just fixing my eyebrows. So I'm taking Melba by MAC and it's just this really pretty peachy blush. And I did dust off all of the powder that I had underneath my eyes with this Real Techniques setting brush. Which is an awesome brush just for underneath the eyes to set your powder and all of that. It's a really good brush. Okay, so now that I got that on there, I'm going to take this highlight that I did mention in my last video that I'm obsessed with. And I'm taking this Sigma Tapered Highlighting Brush and I'm just going to swirl it. And you just need a little bit. And I'm just going to highlight my face. Put a little bit on my nose and on my chin. Now I'm just going to finish my eyes I'm going to take a white eyeliner. I'm going to take this NYX white eyeliner and put it on my waterline. And I already did apply more um, eyeliner to the top of my eyes because it, um, whatchamacallit. It. 
It covers my glue. Oh my gosh, I'm so slow today. I'm so hungry. Okay, so. Oh yeah, I just learned this trick. Like, use the brush that you used for underneath your eyes. Just to pull on your eye a little bit. To put your eyeliner on. Because if you use your finger, you're going to see like your finger mark there. And you do not want that. Okay, so I just put some white eyeliner there and then now I'm going to go with this brush. I really like this brush for, it's like just a flat brush for un um, underneath my waterline to add some shadow. And I'm going to take Nooner, which is from the Naked 3 that I used a little bit onto my crease, which is this color right here. I'm just going to take a little bit and just apply it right underneath my waterline. Okay, so now for lips, I'm going to take my favorite lipstick, and it's by Maybelline, of course. A uh, touch of spice. I feel like it really looks nice with this eyeshadow look. So I'm just going to apply it. Yay, I did it! Okay, so one more thing. Completely forgot. It's my favorite thing to do. I'm going to go back to the chocolate bar and I'm going to grab this highlight color and put that right in between my eyes, my inner tear duct. Just a little bit. This brush picks up a little bit of shadow. So it's perfect. Because I don't want to do too, too much. So this is a completed look. I really like this look. I did a little bit extra today because, you know, it's not that hot outside. It actually feels great. Um, it's like not too, too, too hot. I'm about to check the weather right now. 75. Oh, it might rain. But it's 75 degrees and I'm pretty excited because it's not that hot. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.